Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Being the Odds. It is Thursday, September 28, 2023, and we are back with our MLB Best Bets of the Day. If you're new to the channel, my name is Zach, and welcome to Being the Odds. Hit that subscribe button, like this video, hit the notification bell so you never miss a pick. We post MLB videos every single day, along with the NFL and college football. We have videos for both those right now, they are loaded. Definitely go check those out. We're also going to have a big winning years, the NBA, college basketball, and a winning year in the NHL. Uh, we're going after our first 15,000 subscribers, our first eight months on YouTube. So I'm really excited to have you all here. Let's go win together today. Let's go make some money. So to recap yesterday's results, we had a great day. Went 3-0 yesterday. We had the Astros money line minus 124. That was a winner. Uh, we had no runs first inning in the Blue Jays and Yankees, minus 135, winner. Uh, we had the Braves team total over 5.5. We went into the ninth with three runs, ended up with six. Love to see it. Uh, plus 100 winner. Love to get it. So overall 3-0, 25.09 units for the year so far in the MLB. Uh, we have three picks today in the MLB. Let's get started with our first play of the day, which is going to be um, a, a, actually a parlay, a little Brewers and Twins money line parlay. Uh, for the Brewers and Cards, we have a serious pitching advantage with Corbin Burns over Hudson uh, for the Cardinals. The Brewers bullpen has a significant advantage over the Cardinals bullpen. They are, they're, they're both, the Cardinals bullpen is absolutely horrible. They've given up so many leads this year. It's pretty unbelievable. I like the lineup for the Brewers better because they're going to be more engaged because they're fighting for seeding. It's a rivalry game. They're going to avoid a letdown even while clinching the NL Central last night. I really like the Brewers here to get a dub against the Cardinals. And on top of that, I like the Twins versus the A's. Um, Gray is, Sonny Gray is one of the best pitchers in the league. It's not even close. 288 ERA for the year. Unbelievable. Going against Medina, who has a 5-6-1. So we have a serious advantage there. Uh, the, Brewer, the Minnesota bullpen is way better than the A's bullpen. A's is second or third worst in the league. I think they're second worst in the league. Um, and the Minnesota's lineup, I like them more than the A's lineup, obviously. Plus, Minnesota's fighting for seeding in the AL. So, they're going to be. They're they're going to. Um, they're going to put very heavy emphasis on this game, even though they basically clinched the AL Central. I love the Twins here to get a WCA. So the parlay will be minus one hundred and one. Next, we have no runs first inning in Kansas City, Detroit, minus, minus 130. This is for game two, not game one. Both have surprisingly underrated pitchers in today. Uh, Detroit is not a good offense whatsoever, and Kansas City usually picks up a little bit later um, in games. They typically start slow, though. So I like with the fact that both start slow, and Detroit's not a great offense. They've got good pitching. I like the no runs first inning there in game two of KC and Detroit. And lastly, the Cubs money line at plus 124 versus the Braves. Uh, Stroman is a lot better than Smith Shire. Uh, and the Braves, the Braves do have a bullpen advantage here. The lines are about equal, in my opinion. But in all reality, the Cubs are the, are the hungrier dog in this scenario. Uh, the, the Braves clinched the number one seed last night, not just in the NL, but just in general. They have home, they have home field advantage for the whole playoffs. Okuni got his 40 and 70 moment, which was awesome, by the way, yesterday. It was so cool to see. And this, and, and this is a classic letdown spot. When you've clinched the number one seed, you can't, you can't go any higher. Your best player had, broke, made history last night. The next game is going to be a letdown. I get the money line at plus 124. I love those odds. I'm going to take the Cubs here in my land, plus 124. Now, like I said, we might be adding some more picks throughout the day. Uh, members, you'll also text you. I'll on my Twitter. My Twitter is linked in the description below. And we may have money in the MLB, NFL, college football, NBA, college basketball. Become a member at zdmbets.com slash picks. Today, we have three members-only plays in the NFL and college football today. Um, as, as a member, you all have our members-only plays, which are our most profitable plays and best bets. Also, you have a direct line to me. So any game you're considering, you can reach out to our hotline number. You can guarantee response back. And again, that website is zdmbest.com slash picks, zdmbest.com slash picks, zdmbest.com slash picks. So quick recap we have. We have the Brewers and Twins Moneyline Parlay at minus 101. We have no runs first inning in Kansas City and Detroit, minus 130. And we have the Cubs Moneyline plus 124 versus the Braves. So let's go lock in those picks. Let's go win together today. Let's go make some money. I'll see you all tomorrow. Make sure you all check those other videos.